and welcome back to the Praetorian. Today I am going to be finishing on my reading of the Royal Academy of Science and Projects and that would be the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences <coughs> excuse me that I was reading last but I am going to be going through the Prussian Academy of Sciences and the Academy of Sciences of the Institute of Bologna. Then there's also the French Academy of Sciences and I'll go through them too but on separate videos. So Right now I am on the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences and like I said in my last video I uh, I'm using my uh, introductory video in loop mode because of bad punctuation that I did on my notes. I did these back in 2013 when I was starting to get interested in um, doing research and everything and taking notes. But the only problem is, is I uh, hadn't written in quite a long time and I got a little happy with the periods and exclamation points and the commas so I had to actually go back and start working on my punctuation with writing so that's the reason why this is here instead of showing the notes like I've done on the other ones I'm not saying those are any better but at least it's not my writing um, with that being said I'm also going to say this is the. Uh, I'm going to uh, keep this video down to 15 minutes, at least 15 minutes if I can, so that I don't make uh, a long read out of all of this stuff. I need to get through it and at the same time keep my uh, video short. So, with that being said, I will tell you that I made the note this note back on September the 21st 2013 and I am now into the second part of the uh, topic on the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences and I'm going to talk about the publications now. Publications, the transactions of the Academy 
were published as its main series between 1739 and 1974. In parallel, other major series have appeared and gone. And those series would be Off Virgit F. Kong, O F V E R S I G T A F Kong K U N G Congo actually K U G L But in Skepsakademians V E T E N S K A P S A K A D E M I E N S for Handlingar F O R H A N D L I N G A R that was between 1844 to 1903. Then we have Bai Hung Til. Bai Hung, B I H A N G Til, T I L L. But in Shapsakademians, V E T E N S K A P S A K E D E M I E N S and Lingar H A N D L I N G A R. That was between eighteen seventy two to nineteen o two. Then we have Vetin Skepsakdemians R. Spock V E T E N S K A P S A K A D E M I E N S R. Spock A R S B O K and that was between 1903 to 1969. The Academy started publishing annual reports on physics and chemistry in 1826, technology in 1827, botany in 1831, and zoology in 1832. These, these lasted and into the 1860s when they were replaced by the single Bai Hong series, series and Bai Hong is spelled B-I-H-A-N-G meaning supplement to the transactions. Starting in 1887 this series was once again split into four sections of Delning a F D E L N I N G, which in 1903 became independent scientific journals of their own titled, of their own titled, Archive Four, Archive Four. Among them, Archive Four, Mathematik, Astronomy, which or Och Foisik Archive A R K I V four F O R Mathematic M A T E A no E M A T I K Astronomy A S T R O N O M I Och O C H Foisik F Y S I K and that was between 1903 to 1949. Further restructuring of their topics occurred in 1949 and 1974. Current publications 
Ambio, 1972. Oct started in 1972. And that's spelled A M B I O. Octa Mathematica, A C T A M A T H E M A T I C A. And that was started in 1882. Archive. For mathematic, A R K I V F O R M A T E M A T I K, and that was started in 1949 with this title, 1903 through 1949, also including physics and astronomy. Acta Zoologica. Zoologica, A C T A Z O O L O G I C A, and that was started in 1920. Lev Nad L E V N A D S T E C K N I N G A R, over. O V E R Vetinskaps Academians V E T E N S K A P S A K A D E M I E N S Ladamater L E D A M O T E R and that was started in 1869. Biographies of deceased members. Then there's Portrait Matricel. Portrait Matricri Matricel, which is spelled P or Portrait Matricel. Which is P O R T R A T T M A T R I K E L, started in 1971. Portraits of current members. Then there is Zoologica Scripta. Z O L Z O O L I. Sorry, let me start. Z O O L O G I C A Scripta S C R I P T A, which was started in 1972 jointly with the Norwegian Academy of Science and Letters. History The Academy was founded on June the 2nd, 1739 by naturalist Carl Linnaeus. Mercedes Jonas Alstromer, mechanical engineer Martin Trywald, civil servants Sten Carl Bielke and Carl Wilhelm Cederhelm or Helm Cederhelm. F C E D E R H I E L M and statesman author Anders Johann von Hopkin. The purpose of the Academy was to focus on practical, useful knowledge and to publish in Swedish in order to widely disseminate the Academy's findings. The Academy was intended to be different from the Royal Society of Sciences in Uppsala, which had been founded in 1799 and published in Latin. The location close to the commercial activities in Sweden's capital, which unlike Uppsala, U-P-P-S-A-L-A, did not have a, univers a university at this time was also intentional. The Academy was modeled after the Royal Society of London and 
Academie Royale des Sciences in Paris, France, which some of the founding members were familiar with. Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and keep these videos down to 15 minutes. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, thank you for watching and have a good day. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please like, subscribe, share, and comment. Let's keep it.